Hello, Mr. Daniel Smith, the NASCAR driver. What yeah, is what? it like being a NASCAR driver? Does the pressure ever get to you? Uh, not really, because I have a competition, so um, it's not that bad, but... I, I'm, I, yeah, I like the other racing drivers, Joel's quite nice, Reese is quite nice, but we all get along pretty happily in them. Um, yeah, I'm pretty confident I'm going to win today. Due to the uh, other races... Oh, hang on, hang on, so I've, got, I've got a phone call. Hello? Hello? Hi! Hi! Oh, yeah. I do apologise. Mm. Yeah, okay. Meanwhile, where are you so, on yeah. the phone? I'm back. Alright, he's back. So okay, so, as I was saying, what is it like being the only transvestite racer in the league? Well, it's quite hard, because, um, um, you get a lot of Mickey taken out of you, but when you beat them and flash them, then they shut up, so it's okay. Okay, so, uh, you feel well prepared for this race? Yeah, I do. Well, somebody smashed my windows today, and I can't just to fix them, so, um, I've got some, I'm going to have some performance lost because of the airflow, but, um, looking at Joel's car, it's pretty, uh, I think I'll be okay. One last question, uh, how much do you charge for a hug? Nothing. Yay! Phil, would you like to explain? So, what happens is you drive down this straight, now this is where it gets technical, because there's a thing called a turn. And you have to follow that turn left for most of the race. Now, although the turn doesn't change, the track does due to it being dirt. Now, we enter the other straight. Now, this may confuse the drivers as they've just cut off a turn. So, we enter another turn. And this can cause <laughs> the drivers to become very disoriented because they're used to drag races. And then we enter the straight, and this is where we come to another straight and across the line. Video rendered. Shut up. So we have a Pontiac with an engine sticking out the bonnet for extra air intake. Now we have a Dodge. Wait, Phil, get out of the way. I'm avoiding the badges. Now, uh, now we've got a Dodge. I can't remember which make, but it's black and it looks very mean and it's modern. So this could be a great contender. And now we have another Pontiac. We have racing wheels, racing spoiler and some racing stripes. This could be another good attention for the other Pontiac. I think the good, a good car for this race is going to be the Dodge. Over to you, Phil. I'll tell you what, Jack. I'll tell you what. It's, we're feeling really heated down here on the ground. I don't suppose you can tell because you're so high up in the air. But um, it's a three-way race I for the Piston <laughs> Cup. We have Lightning McQueen over here. He is feeling very confident about this race. And then in the middle, we do have... What's his name? What's the green Chick. one's name? Chick. 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 Here we have Chick. Uh, that's a pretty gay name for a boy, so he gets quite pissy. Now, over here on the right, we do, well, you're left actually, but never mind that. We do have the king. The king. Name's the king. But he is in green because he's got all eco like a hippie. So Thank it's going you to be a very close that. race. Now, for the would the cup. cars like to take their positions on the grid? Uh, <laughs> well, it's going to be very close, but with my racing experience in the ambulance Ferrari, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that the um, that the king has got this pretty much in the bag, but we're not too sure how much engine upgrades the others have but or how I, much chick is but on this period. I've seen quite a big problem with Light like, McQueen's <coughs> car. It has got some smash windows which could increase its power because it may be lighter and it's got a smash brake light that the stewards might have an inquiry about. But this is NASCAR, well, yeah. we don't have stewards. <coughs> well, this is America, so they probably just say, Ah, what the hell? So it doesn't matter. Oh. So, we're just going to get on with it. Oh, ice cream! I do love you, Joe. Thank hey. you, Joe. Phil. <laughs> right. Racers, are you ready? Rev your engines, spin those wheels if you are ready. Three. Oh, sorry. Ready, steady, go! Hey! Get up there! Get up there! There's a man! Bit of a cut there as they come flying into the first corner. It seems the Dodge has taken the lead and the two Pontiacs are right behind. I'm now, scared of heights. We're in a helicopter field. This isn't a good time to say you're scared of heights. And we can't see them because <laughs> their dust is causing a lot of dust. 
What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no I tell you what, Jack, we are really flying along here, quite literally. Yeah, now looking down the track, <laughs> it turned out that George has no. You got George's chick. <laughs> what am I saying? <laughs> it must be the ice cream. <laughs> 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 Yeah, they are, we are flying now, but Dodge, as I have predicted, it has been, has taken the lead at an early stage, but Phil, how many laps is this, would you like to explain, as they come around for the well, what, what I'll swim in my mouth now, but, if it's her out well, it's a pole, <laughs> it's a pole. The Dodge seems to be pulling a ginormous lead away from the two Pontiacs. I'll tell you what, I, I did not expect this, but this isn't how it went down in the film, but it just shows, that edge of that really can change it Yeah, they can. As he exits the corner, they just come halfway around it. And then they try and they chase him. Lightning McQueen is in second. And the Green Machine is in third. And the Dodge is in third. Yeah, that we ran for Dynaco didn't do it any good. It actually lost, uh, lost sales because they looked like hippies. Thank you, that. Now the lights have been flashing on Daniel on uh, Light McQueen's car as they come into. They have just onto their third. <coughs> quite pulling away quite substantially now. They, the two Pontiacs are going to have to pull out the bag to, bag to get back in this, aren't they, Phil? Yeah, maybe a rubber out the hat. Anything will do that's good at this race. Lose yeah. some weight, get really done. And now it turns out that um, one of the races has actually had some ice cream <coughs> before the race. This is actually affecting their performance. Is now it's the, the king who has actually decided for this, and he's actually gained weight quite substantially, and he's kind of chugging along behind. But it's yeah. also it doesn't it isn't helped by Lightning McQueen supreme defending. Yeah, the, the he is blocking quite quite well there. So it seems to be a race between the two Pontiacs, and the Dodge is out front. But he seems to be. Oh, slowing. just throw ice cream on my trousers and it looks like I cut myself. I do apologise. It was a sudden turn. The Pontiacs <coughs> are battling for second. Now, yeah, now look it up? McQueen is pulling away. And, yeah, just uh, get right in there, please. What? Just lick it up. Uh, just lick the ice cream off your trousers. I've got the ball in the spoon. I am not I can't licking reach. the ice cream off your crotch, okay? We are racing. <laughs> it's not come. I, I promise <laughs> it's not come. Alright, oh, the Pontiac has caught up with the Dodge. I don't know what is going on with the Dodge, but we shall find out at the end of this race if, if it has. Why meant to be out. counting the laps? Yes, they are on yeah. their fifth lap now. Yeah, oh, we're only halfway. Jeez, this yeah, is boring. They need some more turns. <coughs> sort of. okay. Oh my god! So, uh, Pontiac has Monaco. Is that another race train? I don't know. <laughs> oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, Phil! Phil! Phil. What are you doing down there? I'll tell you what, more experience down here on the track is very <coughs> slow, but I can really see how they're making marks in the dirt. It just shows that it's a bit too muddy. They have got a lot of power, so the mechanics have been saying that their cars are reaching over. When do we go for pit stops? Now they are coming in to their, their seventh lap. As I come round, they should shoot straight underneath my chopper. Here they come, battling it out. Hello, everybody. Battling it out, yes. On to their tenth and final lap. Now the Pontiac. Oh my God! There's an special. They're gonna have to pull something really special out of the bag to win this. The Pontiacs. Oh, tell you what, there's an ant right here. It's so big. Oh. <laughs> Phil, please I'm... get off the track. We don't want you to die. Right now they're coming round. Oh, the Dodge is I pulling away that. after after the Lightning McQueen has. Can I just say something? The Dodge jumped the start. No, it didn't. Yeah, yeah, it yeah, did. No, it did. And we, we were going to have play. We will watch the replay. How does your cowboy hat fit on so perfectly? Because my bowler hat, I'll tell you, I'll get itches and scratches all day long. Mate, I'm American. It looks very American it, to me. It fits everybody's hat. Head, by head shape. You always is an English man with your with your tie and your shirt and your stupid shorts. <laughs> Who have you got shoes. against English people? I don't do that. I don't do that. Oh, 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 it's broken out. I cannot stop it. It's got out of control. It's really good out of control. I'm going to taser them. I'm taser them. I'm tasering them. Oh, 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 dear. This is a guy. Well, just... Everyone, calm the hell out. Come on. Just calm down, people. Come on. <laughs> oh, there's someone attacking the chopper. We are, this is being Phil reported to you live. Please put this on BBC News. Or I do love the telly. Right. Hi there, viewers. 
You were looking at my face in the chopper and Phil was... Get the hell out of me, they're, they're mad, but I'll tell you, get go, 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 go! We are leaving the place. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this amazing NASCAR race. We will see you in the next one. Shit! This one... Phil! Phil! I taught me ice cream, didn't I? Oh, right, yeah. So, uh, we will see you in the next race. Should be a street race up in Vinewood Hills. See you in the next one. Well, that sounds smashy. Yeah, it does. Yeah, that's right, damn